6 Goofy Myths About Foods You Probably Believe Number 6. You Should Drink 8 Glasses of Water A Day the idea that we should drink 8 glasses of water every day is another common urban legend, and just like the 7 year gum myth, it's not entirely clear where it even came from. According to Snopes, the oldest example of the myth appears to be a 1945 statement by the Food and Nutrition Board of the National Research Council which suggested that people should consume at least 2.5 liters 85 ounces of water a day that would be approximately eight glasses number five all chocolate is bad for you no need for guilt chocolate lovers it turns out that chocolate isn't simply junk food after all chocolate can even be healthy for you According to a study recently published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition, the consumption of cocoa products like chocolate is linked to noticeable decreases in blood pressure. Another study looked at the eating habits of 21,000 adults in England, concluding that people who ate two chocolate bars a day were 11% less likely to experience a heart attack or stroke compared to people who ate no chocolate at all. Number 4. All carbs are bad for you. In the popular consciousness, all you have to do to lose weight is cut back on carbs. After all, our bodies use carbohydrates to produce glucose, which is our main source of energy. Excess glucose is converted to fat. When you eat fewer carbohydrates, your body produces less glucose and has to burn off fat for energy propelling you to a lucrative new modeling contract. At least, that's the general idea. The reality is a little more complicated. Number 3. Gendered food is a new trend. The internet loves to mock hilarious pointlessly gendered products, including earplugs, soda, flash drives, Bibles, and donuts. Sociologist Lisa Wade who runs Pinterest's pointlessly gendered products board, writes that such products can be damaging because they help reinforce gender roles. And the products in question are mostly hilariously bizarre, including a men's baby carrier resembling a bulletproof vest. Number 2. Natural is always better. Customers love food labeled natural prompting food marketers to slap the term on anything they can. But it's actually not really clear what exactly constitutes a natural food. The Food and Drug Administration FDA, currently doesn't have a strict definition for the term, explaining from a food science perspective. It is difficult to define a food product that is natural because the food has probably been processed and is no longer the product of the earth. Number 1. Fried foods always increase heart disease risk. As covered earlier, chocolates and carbs often get undeserved bad reputations. However, fried food might have the worst reputation of them all. And it's true that you probably shouldn't be mainlining KFC on a daily basis. But there are some forms of fried food that can be beneficial. A study published in the British medical journal surveyed 41,000 Spanish adults over 11 years, monitoring how much fried food each consumed daily.